Hello! This is Jean coming to you from Paris, France. I am here today because my cousin, Miss Klein, asked me if I could give a little art lesson for your community day. So I thought about it and I said, yeah, okay, I can do that. So I asked Miss Klein, well, what art project you want me to do with these kids? So she says, well, you know, they learn about these saints there. Oh, okay. We're going to drum roll, please. Draw your community saint. Oh, it came to me like a vision. I think it was the Holy Spirit. I do not want to hear anybody say, Jacques, I cannot draw. What? You cannot draw yet. That's because you have not had me as a teacher. So if you are ready to take this adventure with me into the art world, put your, how you say, party pants on and let's go. Okay. So for this saint, we are going to draw Saint Maria Goretti. You will need your paper, a pencil with an eraser because you know, mistakes happen and a marker. The first thing you are going to do is at the top of the paper, you're going to come a little ways down and you are going to draw a U shape. This is Maria's face. Do not put a top air on it yet. Okay, do that now. Okay, now we are going to draw, before we start with her face, her body. So you come to the edge of her chin and draw a curvy line down, just like that. And you will do the same thing on the other side. Now, you are going to draw her little shoes at the bottom. So you draw a little oval over there and a little oval over there. She had little feet because, you know, she was a little girl. And then you are going to finish the body across like that. Now, you come up here where this line for her body meets the line for the face. And you draw a little curvy line down like that. And do the same thing on the other side. You do not want them to touch in the middle. You want a little space there. Okay. Okay. We are going to connect this line to this line by drawing like that. And you will do the same thing to the other side. Okay, now at this corner right here, you will draw a straight line coming out and then a line going up and connecting it. And do the same thing to the other side. It does not have to be perfect. It doesn't matter if you mess up or if it looks a little bit different than your friends. It's okay. Now, we are going to draw two little ovals. These are going to be her praying hands because St. Maria Goretti loved to pray. And you might need to erase it's okay if they overlap those lines. Just erase the line in the middle of the oval. And we see Maria Goretti with lilies in her pictures. That's because, I'm sure you know, that Maria Goretti appeared to the man that killed her with lilies in her hands. So we are going to draw some little lilies 
coming out of her hands. So we'll draw one right here. Put a little stem coming up and a center for your flower. And just little petals. It's okay if it doesn't really look like a lily. Do your best. Jacques just made a beautiful flower. I don't think that's a lily. <laughs> and draw another lily in her other hand. It's okay if it overlaps. We will color it later. Okay. Now we are going to move to her face. So you come to the top and we're going to draw her hair. And you come to the top about here and you draw a little curvy line that connects to her face. And you do the same thing on the other side, like that. And now you come here and you draw a line from the middle all the way down to her back. That's her hair. And we do the same thing on the other side. Oh, beautiful. And now she's a happy girl. So we give her a little, she's smiling. She can have little squinty eyes because she's smiling like that. And a little tiny nose because she was a little girl and a big smile. Because she's in heaven with Jesus. She's so happy. And now just a little detail over her shoe. Her little dress. Is coming up over her shoe. And we will finish her picture with a halo above. Okay. Now Jacques likes to outline his pictures with a Sharpie. You do not have to. But it makes it look a little more finished. Happy Saint Maria Goretti. And do not forget on your paintings or your drawings, excuse me, you always want to sign your name. Now you can color your picture however you want. And just remember, if it's not perfect, that's okay. None of us are perfect. So your drawings are unique just like each of you. That was so fun. Thank you for inviting me to come teach you how to draw your saint. Tell Miss Klein that I need to see all those pictures. If you want me to help you on your next community day, let me know. Otherwise, I am signing off. I will see you later. Bye-bye. <laughs>